Hey, welcome back. This is Zombie Tiger Willie, and we are back with Distraint. Uh, I found out what I was supposed to do. I don't know how I didn't figure this out, but we have to talk to the grandma. So, let's see what she's got to say. I fell down and couldn't get up. Oh. Yes. Is this Mr. Price speaking? Yeah. My name is Stewards. I'm sorry to bother you at such a late hour. What's this all about? It's Mrs. Goodwin. I know you're not relative, but I'm afraid she has no one else. She asked me to call you. See, she had a stroke yesterday. Oh, how's she doing? Well, considering the seriousness of the stroke, she's fine. But she's very, she's in very low spirits. And when the mind fa falls, the body will follow. I'm sorry to hear, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. I'm sorry, I didn't, I don't know what to say. I understand, but she asked specifically for you, Mr. Price. Did you consider visiting her here in our care? I'm sure it would mean a lot to her. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I will have, yeah, yeah, yes, I will happily do it. Thank you, Mr. Price. I will bring the message to her. I'm sure she will be delighted. Thank you, Mr. It's a guy. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Stewart. Okay. I can't move. Uh. Huh? What a nightmare. Oh, shit. I wonder how Mrs. Goodwin is doing. Maybe I should visit her for my own sake. Maybe you should. I wouldn't, but... Uh, <laughs> all sorts of weird junk here. I need coffee first. I'll just suit up later. He loves his coffee. Okay. Oh, there's the door. Coffee first! Man. I was finally able to buy a telephone, thanks to my latest gig. Cool. I've had I have a superb bladder. I can hold it for a day or two. That's not healthy. I don't need to wash my hands. That's disgusting. Where's your shower? Oh, All right, now coffee. Ah, my new coffee maker, Deluxe 2000 X748 G3. Yuck. One press of a button is enough. No more fetching water from the weirdest of places. Luxury, one could call it. Lucky you. It's a kitchen sink. It's a while. It's a while since I last used my oven. Take away for the wind. Now, now, I need to be patient. Huh, who might that be? I thought that was a film. Hello, this is Price speaking. Mr. Price? This is Stewart speaking. I'm calling from our nursing home on behalf of Mrs. Goodwin. Is... Is everything okay? She had a stroke. But she's doing relatively fine. Let me guess, she asked me to visit her. 
Impressive, Mr. Price. Indeed so. It would mean the world to her. Could you please consider doing so? Yes, of course I'll come, I'll come see her. Thank you, Mr. Price. I'll let her know. Thank you for calling me. Oh! Gah! My dreams of guilt are coming true. Ha 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 ha! You are right, dear. I will never forget that day. Oh, look, dear, it's our little boy. I can see that, hon. Hey, son, you don't mind. We took some coffee already. The coffee tastes great this time. Not at all, since you're here. I guess you have something important to tell me. That is correct, son. That's the dad talking. It seems you are still pursuing the riches at the expense of others. What your father is trying to tell you is that you are losing yourself in the process. I think I know what you mean. But I can't quit now. I'm so close to success. How about Mrs. Goodwin? We heard she's not doing too good. Don't you think she would rather be at her home? I know. I feel horrible for her. Maybe you would understand if you saw the consequences of your actions. You should go and see how Mrs. Goodwin is doing. Hey, you don't need to be so pushy. No, no, son, we do. We are only thinking what would be the best for you. Sorry, I know that. See, you can be very compassionate, honey. Ah, don't tell me. Oh, I thought it was going to be the elephant. <laughs> Is anyone home? I'm looking for Mr. Price. Oh, man, I'm losing my mind. Okay, focus. Drink the coffee and suit up. I need to get my head straight. You finally had your coffee. Damn good coffee. Okay, I'll get dressed and I'm off. Wasn't there somebody at the door? Don't you need to bathe? At least. You know? Or not? All right, I'll pay Mrs. Goodwin a visit. I hope she's okay. Probably not. <laughs> I traveled to meet Mrs. Goodwin. I hated myself. But maybe, if I confront her, maybe I could find peace of mind. Deception? <laughs> Good day, madam. I'll get going now. Snow. No wonder these folks are so absent. Why does it look like friggin' Humpty Dumpty? Ahem. Can I get past, please? No point. He's sleeping like a rock. Why would you ask him if he could get past, if you could pass him when he's not even in the way? <coughs> Let's see how far it goes. Oh my. Ah! I thought I heard something. Hey kid, could you do an old man a favor? Sorry, who are you? Don't ask who that person is when you were the one that walked up in their room. Janitor, carpenter at your service. My name's Price, nice to meet you. And sure, what do you need? I was in the middle of a something. But the... Then, the electricity went off. I'm guessing the circuit breaker tripped. 
There is a fuse box near the kitchen. Could you check the fuses over there? I guess I'm not in a hurry, so why not? Thanks, kid. I'll let you borrow my key. Tell no one. Alright, be right back. You're kidding, right? Right? <sighs> I have a key here. Janitor's key. I don't think they care. Okay. Hello? Anyone there? I'm here to see Mrs. Goodwin. Speaking of service. <sighs> okay. There's no way I get past that. Oh, yeah. There's no keel. <laughs> okay. No, the key wouldn't work here. Oh. What the hell is this program? I better just leave it. Uh, I'm not sure what exactly they want me to do here. Potatoes, potatoes, potatoes! Potatoes! I refuse! I shall not cook anything. No! Potatoes! My skills are going to waste. I refuse. I need better ingredients. It would be nice to have some meat every now and then. Go away! Get lost! Uh. Let's follow her! <laughs> She's gone. Weird. I'm really not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Ew, who's that guy? Hello. I'm frustrated. Only potatoes after potatoes. Yes, I overheard the conversation. Savings, they call it. These people need better food. But I can't provide them with only potatoes. I'm sorry. Leave me alone. Oh, well, dang. Jeez. It's locked. I got a key. I unlocked the door. Mm. This must be the fuse box. Hooray. Let's see. Yeah. What? Ha! Got it. The electricity should be back on. It is, thanks to me. So now we go back to that guy and let him know. Ah. Uh, what now? This is just weird. Oh, okay. I thought we broke some. I think it was this door. Yeah. Uh.
Excuse me. Hey. Hey. Ah, thanks, kid. Electricity is back on. What the hell are you doing? Like, seriously, what are you doing? I'm disposing of this corpse. Excuse me? Why? What did you do? Oh, man. Corpse? Who is that? Just an oldster. Oh, my God. What kind of place is this? He died a few days back. Oh, my God. Why are you not being watched? Like, how did you even get away with this? It's cheaper this way. Is this what you really do? Like, like he, he's, he's a janitor. I, I, like, who, what, where in your job description does it say that this is the proper way to dispose of someone who has died? Like, they had a family <laughs> that cared about them. I'm pretty sure they wouldn't, they wouldn't want this to happen. Ugh, I feel sick. What's that? I don't know what to say. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you. <laughs> I'm gonna throw up any moment now. Piles of guts, bodily fluids, and blood. This will have to do. What? Why? Like, why? I, I just don't understand. And why did I pick up meat? Why? <sighs> I don't understand. Meat delivery. That might not sound too appealing. I got a feeling I know who to give this to. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I think I know who to give this to. <laughs> if I can. Where is that guy? I think I could have swore. Okay, I'll just maybe try one of these doors. I think it was this one. Yeah, it was. You want meat? I got meat. <laughs> I happened to come across this fine piece of beef. <laughs> Do you think it could be suitable for your purposes? Let's take a look. Yes. Oh, brilliant. This is messed up. <laughs> Meat's back on the menu, boys. <laughs> Thank you, young master. I'll start cooking right away. My pleasure. Um, what the hell is going on? This is just not right. I don't need to wash my hands right now. Well, I don't like using public toilets. Whatever. Uh. I don't like this nursing home. I wouldn't send anybody here. Ugh. Can't get past that guy. Ah, of course. Like... Yeah. Yeah.
<laughs> I, I don't even know what to say to that. Oh, anyone there? I'm here to see Mrs. Kidwin. Speaking of service, I just don't understand. I'm just gonna end it right here. Things are really getting weird. Uh, let me know what you guys think of this. Uh, thank you for watching. Please leave a like. Please subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.